Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And ladies and gentlemen of the House, we ought not bet against Ukraine, and we ought not bet against Georgia. I recently returned from a delegation of the House Democracy Partnership. This is a bipartisan delegation over the 4th of July recess that visited Ukraine and visited Georgia. And our purpose to was, re was to reflect this body to those parliamentary bodies in Ukraine and Georgia. And I'll tell you this, I came away, and I know the other members of the House Democracy Partnership came away with a feeling of very seriousness, a feeling of encouragement, a feeling of gratitude for the tenacity with which the Ukrainians and the Georgians are pursuing freedom. These are two nations that desperately want to be in the orbit of the West. They desperately want to be a part of the EU. They desperately want to be a part of NATO. And they are doing everything they can to stiff arm and push back from the aggression of Vladimir Putin. And they need one thing. They need our help. They need our encouragement. And they need our support. It's said that there are some who look at this as the front line of the rising voices against authoritarianism, and I think that that's true. So we've got to do everything we can in this body, not only to provide the, the economic support and other support that these, these countries need, but also to everything we can to push the administration to do the right thing as well. I yield back.